Mr. Jansen. <coughs> Thank you, Madam Chairman. I'm going to go over previously traversed ground, Mr. Sines. Um, we should be opening two schools next fall. It's unfortunate that we didn't plan. That we did not plan that far ahead. We need, we must start the planning process for these other students that are moving in so that when we finish this school, we don't have another three or 400 students overcrowding the current schools waiting for another four years. That's not acceptable. As I told you before, I am still, as I sit here, struggling with supporting this. My concern is, as I stated previously, we approve this, the concept design or whatever you wish to call it at this point comes back to us. And oh, by the way, we are on this critical path, the CPM, which is bleeding as we sit here and speak, bleeding red, we need to move forward. And we can't get a reforestation permit to build a separate building, so we're gonna have to build it onto the existing building or the cost is too prohibitive because of the extensive grading, the extensive stormwater management that's required. And oh, by the way, those permits are not easy to come by. We don't have them. So that's my concern. And I just, I'm looking at the reports here and it says there appears to be sufficient space for a separate building. That just really doesn't give me a warm fuzzy that we're going to be successful with the separate building. And I do not support <clears throat> no way, shape, or form putting an addition onto the school that sits there. The Building and Contracts Committee amended the uh, exhibit to read new elementary school, number one. Number two, uh, the firm that we engaged, uh, we've been very pleased with their performance and their, the quality of the turnaround that they provided us in a very short window. One of the overriding issues we talked about on a regular basis, almost daily, don't give us an option unless you can build it. Now, I, the permitting is certainly problematic. We have civil engineers on staff. We're intimate with the school campus. If we had any hesitation in terms of our ability to move this forward and achieve the objective of providing a safe environment, new seats for 400 students, I wouldn't be sitting at the table. Separate. It's a, it's yes. a new school. It's not an addition. Separate. Thank you for that reassurance, Mr. Sines. But <laughs> once again, the cynic in me comes up that currently this board sits here and we have a couple of choices in front of us, three or six months, whenever you believe you'll bring this back to us. And I was just looking at the timeline and forgot, I believe it's sometime uh, late summer, early fall. There's going to be a gun in our head. There will be no other option if it's determined that we cannot build it in the time frame that has been established unless we make an addition. And I don't like zero choices when I'm looking at any options because there are no options for us to look at. <coughs> 